Oh, hey there, YouTube. I'm back here for our Gen Con, but it's explosion blood coverage here live at Gen Con 2021. And this is actually going to be more of a guided tour right now. Because one of the coolest things about Gen Con, if you've ever been to it, is the fact that there is a system of tubes, these little tunnels that will connect to a whole bunch of different hotels. 22 hotels in general. So I'm actually going to be taking you on one of these little tunnel tours so you can see how we can get from the Indianapolis Convention Center, because we are currently upstairs at the Indianapolis Convention Center, all the way to my hotel, number nine, the Fairfield Inn and Suites, which is right next to the 16, which is a massive JW Marriott. And the first thing I'd recommend, if you're newer to Gen Con, upstairs is the place to go to the bathroom. Undoubtedly, there's so many less people up here. There's so many... Uh, bathrooms that get get used a lot less so if you really got a poo highly recommend using the upstairs oh beautiful now one thing I do want to mention is that I'm not gonna be talking too much unless I need to talk just because I'm trying to save my voice and I know you don't want to just hear me blabbering on about absolutely nothing so I'll just talk a walk let's talk in more walking even though I do have to adjust my fanny pack I got an awesome fanny pack oh. Okay. Oh, look at the games library. All right, we're going to take a sneak peek. Games library, look at that. Oh my gosh, so many games. So many games. What, that, that's for a different video. We will do a Gen Con after dark where I will walk you all around. I think we're going to do a live stream on that one if my if Ryan Reynolds will let me do it on Mint Mobile. Uh, but we'll do a live stream and we'll just walk all around Gen Con after dark see what it's like and hey there's the western right there and that's one of the best parts about gen con is that if you stay downtown there's a decent chance that you'll be able to just never go outside if you don't want to So we're coming up to the first tube, which I don't think is our tube, but we'll double check on the map. I think we're actually gonna have to go downstairs, take a right, then keep going to a different tube. Cause yeah, there's a whole bunch of tubes. Oh my God, my fairy packs look full. It's making me so mad. All right, where are we? Where's a star? Is there a star somewhere on here? This could use a star. All right, so I think 22, yeah, 22 is the Westin right there. So we need to keep going forward, because as you can see, no connection. So we're gonna go downstairs into the heart of the beast. Oh yeah, I just adjusted that fanny pack so hard. Hopefully I won't have to adjust it anymore. Part of the problem is my fanny pack weighs about eight pounds. In case you're curious, that is generally the line. It's a will call. Normally, it would stretch out for just all the way out the door. And no, I'm not even exaggerating. I've seen it stretch all the way to the, the door, which we're going to... You'll see. But normally, there would just be a sea of people oh, right here sheet. waiting in line. Nice single file line. Jet got store! That is truly a testament to how well they are handling Gen Con right now. That the uh, the store currently has a longer line than the will call does. So hats off to Gen Con for how they're handling it this year. Double exposure play test hall. So they moved this. It w I wonder if this is a bigger one. Oh, let's peek in. Oh yeah. Oh my gosh, that is huge. That is so much bigger than the previous one. I will be in there quite a few times this weekend getting interviews for all the hottest newest games so be sure to uh, check that out fun fact one thing i like to do after dark is i'll just sit right here and i'll meet people here and i'll shoot interviews right there one year i'm gonna i'm gonna do that i'm really gonna well i've done it before but one year i want to actually get people to like make it a big event like hey everybody come down thursday night just i'll interview you until you stop coming Sounded weird. All right, now I think 
here we go. So we're at the very last tube. I can't tell if those are digital or if they just so bright and vivid colors they pop, but either way, I like it. Now the only crummy part about this particular tube, and some of the tubes in general, is they close late at night, which really does kind of suck. Granted, this year won't matter nearly as much because Gen Con is only going to be uh, open until midnight. Whereas normally, I mean, you could find something to do here at 1, 2 in the morning and still see people playing werewolf. Granted, now they do. So I got a grievance to air. You know, I got time to talk. There used to be a giant area where people would play werewolf and other social deduction games. It was free. It was awesome. And then they took it away. Well, they didn't even take it away. Like someone could go over there and start doing it and say, hey, we're doing pickup games of werewolf. Uh, but now they have a designated area where people buy tickets. You know what? Bowers Game Corner should be the one that does the pickup game. So next year, Friday night, Bowers Game Corner, hosting Werewolf at Gen Con. That's a thing. I'm doing it. Mark your calendar. Why not? I need to do more stuff like that. <sighs> oh, oh, JW Marriott. That's where my buddy Brandon's staying. That's a fancy, fancy pants one. Ooh. Oh, wait, that's not it. That's the Marriott. There's like three hotels all in this area. Okay. So hopefully there's a map nearby. All right, so we're in the Marriott, which tells me absolutely nothing, but I said it confidently enough. I think we're actually going to the, uh, the press day. So Wednesday is not, not press day. Wednesday's the trade show day, uh, which is like game store owners, and librarians, I think, and like a whole bunch of other people who work around board games. I've never actually gone to it, aside from a few events here and there. Like they've shown me some card games. Ooh, let's see. The new improved 4% financing. Greening, uh, responsibility for housing finance. Innovative financing for preservation. Like what is this about? I don't even know. I mean, I guess that's all board game related stuff, like board game store related stuff. And now I kind of want to know. I want to go in there and I want to know what that's like. What could I do with Wizard? Oh, it's over for the day. Dirt! Dirt! This video is about to take a, a left turn. Fun fact. Interview Jamie Stagmire there once. So I believe we're lost. I'm scared. I'm alone. I don't hold my camera. I look awkward. And I really have to go to the bathroom. That's the worst part. actually a housing conference normally this is press day but i guess hotels do more than one thing <gasps> whoa there's the tube that's a tunnel that's a tube i think this is what do we take this i don't even know bam i did that softly don't get upset all right so this is a tunnel no this is taking to a parking garage yes okay i lied we didn't go to the right tube i don't think you know what i'm in kickstarter critique mode i'm always in kickstarter critique mode my wife tells me to knock it off more maps more maps would be nice marriott all right, so I'm pretty sure this parking garage. Yeah, there we go. That's the JW over there. So I am going the right way. Yes. Ooh, I feel like Mario. <laughs> I jump into that so bad. Actually, I probably die. So you know what? Hindsight, second thought. Oh, dude. Yeah, we're not in a tube anymore. <laughs> Hopefully, wait, is that tubage? I think that's tubage over there. I think you need to walk this way. Let's see, does that help? Nope, sure don't. Kind of amazed at how few cars are in this parking garage for how massive this building is. Okay, there we go. Convention Center Skywalk. Don't walk into the chain. Somebody ran into it though. <sighs> no mask for a second. 
Let the face breathe. Okay, so I think that's the tube. No, this is gonna take me back to the... Oh, there it is! I, yeah, I think I took the wrong tunnel. I think I need to keep walking down the highway, down the alleyway. There was another tunnel. Fanny pack is messing up again. Damn it. Doing a little bit of a fast walk now. A little potty walk going on. Here we go. Yeah, so I do apologize. I should have continued to walk, then went to this tunnel. But the bottom line is, I can figure it out. Now, if you're newer, I don't know if you'd be able to. Did you do the uh, video on what the pack for Gen Con? I did. We just watched that last night. Great video. Thank you. Woo! -hoo. It's one of my favorite things about Gen Con. I feel like a D-list celebrity. It's real hot. Let me rephrase that: a D-list board game celebrity, not like a D-list like celebrity like in D-list. You know, I'm not like a one of the Baldwin brothers that you don't know, but a D-list board game celebrity. It's pretty hot. By the way, yeah, that, that packing video, I think it's a good one, too. Highly recommend it. And if it was crap, I tell you, it's crap. Don't watch it. No, I mean, this year. Alright, there's the Jake Dub. Almost there. Victory Field. Home of, I think it's like the Aliens or something. It's their minor league team. Indians. I thought it was the Area 51 theme team. Oh well. This fanny pack is about to fall off. I do apologize for the, the camera work at the moment. Alright, let's see. Does it tell me? Does it tell me where to go? <gasps> JW Marriott Lobby, JW Grand Ballroom, restrooms, yeah. Spring Hill Suites, Courtyard, Griffin Hall, White River Ballroom. Nope. Or are you gonna, I guess or we're playing the guessing game. Are you going to screw me over? Well, the JW Marriott is connected to my hotel, which I don't remember the name of. It's been such a long, long walk, and I have to go to the bathroom so bad. So you know what? I think we will call this. We're going to pretend like I stay at the JW Marriott. But I think you've got an idea. The tube system, the tunnels at Gen Con are awesome. Love them. But as always, if you're enjoying this Gen Con coverage, please be sure to click on and subscribe and let me know what you want to see. Some more Gen Con coverage. And always thanks for your time, YouTube.